having a voice doesn't mean you always have to use it. It's, an, it's knowing that it's there whenever you need it. And using your voice in moments that cause you harm knowingly. And I'm loving you and I'm not saying this to you. I'm saying this to myself and to everyone and to all of us. If it's an emotional resistance or if it's just fatigue, um, we're tackling so much more than we know within ourselves, especially as women, because we are here as the nurturers. We're here to like bring life to this world. Um, so it's just, you know, give yourself empathy during this time. With that being said, um, how I want to bring some of you guys that are new up on stage to talk about how the first week has helped that I can give to anybody because I didn't have that. I would give anything to show and share with you girls the best ways to healthily get in the, in the long term better and more motivated and more determined and, and just getting there and finding yourself because you all have it. You have it in you. Every single person has it. It's just a matter of finding the way to bring it out. And that's where it starts is being grateful for what you have and loving yourself now. And that is really hard to do. But when you do that, everything else, it will come to life. It's planting that seed, watching it grow. And the hardest part is getting through the ground. And once you get through the ground, the sun's there and everything and you just blossom and bloom. So we just have to learn how to water those flowers and plant those seeds and watch it. We're all the same and we all go through the same stuff and we all have the same security. So it's amazing that we can get together here um, at Warriors and share our stories and share love. And, you know, every time that I finish this lives, I feel like so full of love. Like if, if something in my chest was like filled and that's filled with all of you guys love so absolutely love what I've seen so far um and I think it's just like you really don't get this anywhere else like this is such a valuable platform to have um because it's you know talking about something that we all in this circle are interested about and we all care about and I'm just like so excited to you know help support this Wanted us to do today was we're going to do a slight meditation. Um, the goal is not to like internalize these fears and like really feel stressed out about them, it's more to just notice, like, okay, what am I like most afraid of right now in my life? Um, and then by writing it down, we're, we're then going to transform it afterwards. So it's more of a chance to like acknowledge a fear and then look beneath it to see like why we have that fear and what we might benefit or how we might grow if we keep trying to overcome um, that fear. I'd like to shout out Kimberly because um, I've been struggling with interacting with new people like I came to Warriors with a, now an army of people that I knew and I've never felt like that need of starting interacting with another people and Kimberly has been encouraging me a lot to start to talk in private with uh, some girls and I really and have to shout out uh, to Capri because she reminds me so much of my little sister and I always end up looking on uh, the little zoom video of her and I'm like oh she's so pretty she looks like my sister <laughs> I know this is random but Capri you are so beautiful and I love you spoken, so today I was like yay <laughs> So I'm so proud of you and I just wanted to shout that out because yes, you did it. <laughs> I love you. I love you. I'll send some capacity. Come on, it's just like welcome in, like with like warm arms, and I'm so excited for you guys to facilitate that for so many girls who, you know, are on the same path as us, just a little bit behind and want to feel the love and feel the magic. So we can do that for them and help so many people. Like we can all do that. Like you guys have helped me and like learning how to be your own idol, your own hero. Like that is, that is it. And so then we can like trust ourselves to be there for others. And then in return, you actually grow more into that um, unlimited potential. So it's really powerful. It's a beautiful cycle. It's like the cycle we want to be in, right? Like, you know, like the term vicious cycle, it's like the opposite of that. It's like the actual hamster wheel we want to be on. So I am, so grateful you guys thank you so much other alexis you are the strongest woman i know 
I am the strongest woman I know. <laughs> Nicole, <laughs> you are so powerful. I'm literally shaking right now. I am so powerful. 